we live in a world where Diet Coke is actually more unhealthy for you than just a regular Coke. And where Missouri Tiger fans like the Mizzou Kid 96 get all excited for their 4-0 Missouri Tigers who have beaten some of the worst teams in the nation and get all excited because their big bad Missouri Tigers are 4-0 and think that they're going to come in to Nashville and spoil Vanderbilt's homecoming. That's the kind of world we live in. Missouri, four and out. Last week, coming on, I guess, a less than impressive win against Arkansas State. But it's a brand new week. When we go to Nashville, play the Vanderbilt Commodores. And they're an imposing stadium of 41,000, I guess you can call that imposing. Missouri, four and out. The Red Hot Missouri Tigers coming to Vanderbilt Stadium for homecoming this Saturday. Nashville, Tennessee with a 4-0 record and they are just blazing through the season. Tearing up the competition with four big victories over four big top caliber teams. The Murray State Racers, the Toledo Rockets, the Indiana Hoosiers, and the Arkansas State Red Wolves. Good job, Mizzou. Because we all know Murray State is a big team, right? They've done a lot of great things in college football, right? I mean, aren't they in some conference called... I don't even know what conference they're in. And then you got the Toledo Rockets. Big victory for Mizzou there. And then they played the worst Big Ten team ever in the Indiana Hoosiers. And then the Arkansas State Red Wolves, a Sun Belt team or something like that. Those are four big games that Mizzou won, and they're coming here and here trails ablaze, and they think they're a big-time team, and they've got revenge on their mind over the doors. Congratulations, Mizzou. You've got arguably, thus far, the easiest schedule in college football. But now it starts the gridiron. Now it starts the big time. Vanderbilt's already faced two big time prime time SEC opponents and all miss in South Carolina and played them damn close. Are y'all looking for some revenge? Well you're not getting it, Mizzou. Sure, you started out 4-0. Sure you got the momentum. But you know how easy those teams are? Do you know how cupcake those teams are? Come on, Mizzou, don't get too excited. Y'all know that this black and gold is more superior than y'all's. Fifty eight to fourteen. Mizzou beat Mary State. 38-23, to y'all seemingly squeak one out over the Rockets of Toledo at home when y'all have home field advantage at Faro Field or Faro Stadium, whatever you call that piece of trash up there in Columbia. Then a 45-28 win over Indiana. Eh. And then y'all dog on Arkansas State 41-19 to or whatever it was. So, Mizzou, I'll give you credit where it's due. Y'all y'all really thrashed those teams for the most part. But it's the start of the big time. It's the start of SEC football for y'all. You're coming to play the big boys. It's only your second year in the SEC. Vanderbilt has been in the SEC. They're one of the longest teams to ever be in the SEC. Have we had the success that most teams, that a lot of teams have? No, we're probably the most unsuccessful team in the SEC. That's just it. I believe we are. But uh, the program's rising up. Everything's rising up. The black and gold is getting hyped, so to speak. And we're not going to let the new kids on the block, Missouri, push us off our pedestal that we're currently building. 
It's homecoming week in Nashville. Mizzou, you picked the wrong time to come in and try to get revenge. Homecoming means the stadium's going to be packed. It's going to get loud. The game's already sold out. I've checked on some tickets. Couldn't get them. Game's already sold out. Get ready, Mizzou. Because this black and gold is more superior than yours. Go doors. Anchor down. Beat the Tigers. Missouri. Four. And out. We have very, very high expectations for this program of where we're going, who we can be, and what we can achieve. And we're going to work at it every single day like crazy. We're not going anywhere, so everybody better get used to it. We're not going anywhere. This is the brand new Vanderbilt. I think you guys remember me sitting up here last year and say, you think the culture changed last year? Wait till you see two years, I think was what we said. Well, this thing is, is, is keep going with the support of David Williams and Chancellor Zeppos and the community who's jumping on board right now. The sky's the limit. So get used, you get used to us.